this um, since eight years old. I've lived in Matlock for 15 years. April of this year, I was referred into the MSK at Chesterfield for a back scan. Well, they took the back scan of me and then uh, gave me the result later on and said that uh, they found out that the bottom of my spine was deteriorating. To do the operation, uh, I would never have recovered sort of thing, so they couldn't do anything about my legs. So they referred me to uh, have physiotherapy on them and treatment and that's when I came to see Jane uh, this year and uh, the senior for about seven eight weeks or so. We went through different processes of exercises daily that I could do and uh, what we got to do sort of thing. And well after seven eight weeks so I found out that I could uh, get about quite easily and I've improved and improved ever since and now I can get about just better than what I could before that been the rest of the fall and uh, I'm back where I was now and enjoying life again. See, uh, the doctor arranged for me to come and see Jane and uh, since then I've improved all the time and without that treatment I don't think I'd have been able to have done anything now. In fact, I don't think it would be no to walk. Uh, I might have even been not here now. I don't know. But uh, everything I've done, I've tried and tried and tried to get back to where I was before I've fallen. And I was talking to a friend of mine the other day and he says, don't forget, this is your 78 now. You're not that you look bad. But he says, you're looking better now than you look for ages. You look for ages. And he says, it's magnificent what you've done. John was referred through to me from Jane Griffiths um, from the MSK service to do the Otago Strength and Balance programme, which we did over eight weeks. Got to know John really well. He was very well motivated and improved greatly. Um, and definitely, I think without our input, he well, he wouldn't be where he is today. Um, he could even be back in hospital and he's continuing to do his exercises daily, and do walk, walk every day, um, and continuing to improve. Hi, my name is Jane Griffiths, I'm an advanced physiotherapy practitioner. John was referred to us by his GP because he'd had a scan that showed uh, some marked nerve compression. His GP wondered if he needed surgery. John's case was further complicated uh, by the fact that he had uh, compartment, bilateral compartment syndrome 15 years ago which were decompressed and that had left him with um, some uh, neurological changes. Um, I think this case demonstrates how important it is to be patient-centred. Uh, John desperately wanted to get his life back on track, his mobility was really poor. Uh, he came to me walk, barely walking on a Zimmer frame. Uh, when I assessed him, I had to sit him down. I couldn't look at him in standing. His muscles were incredibly weak. His balance was poor. Um, he was never going to be a good surgical candidate. He had MRSA. He had a chronic ulcer on his left shin. And that's when I referred him to Jane. And I'm so delighted that he did so well with Jane. His mobility has improved, he's got his life back on track, his ulcer has healed up, his neurological symptoms in his hands and his feet have resolved. Um, so I think this is a, an excellent example of what we can do in, in primary care for patients like John.